Welcome back to the Fellow Hot Gaming Channel. Mountain Blade Warband resuming after a quick five second download. <sighs> Eight years in production, people. Eight years past their original release date. So, 10 to 12 probably in production. And they're still having these kinds of problems because they were so focused on the freaking multiplayer that they couldn't stand themselves. They just couldn't stand themselves when the biggest aspect of this game in my opinion is the single player sure you want to go run around a multiplayer and stab each other fine i enjoy it too i do it too but single player you know it's just like the auto directional blocking it's not there in warband you had an option you could turn it on and off now me i don't really you know i use a shield anyway but there are people in this world who do not have the coordination, and especially since you can't turn the combat speed down like you could in Warband. These guys swing for the fences, and they swing fast. You gotta have those lightning reflexes, and I can block, like even, I'll do an arena fight for you here in a minute and show you. They swing fast, and it's hard to get your direction in right in time unless you have a shield. Now, thankfully, because if you're, we're watching the last video you've seen this option wasn't there now it is you should have seen the list of things that they had already fixed in version 1.0.1 eight years in production i want to know what these guys were doing because this is ridiculous this game should have been so polished, should have been so smooth. Everything should have been beautifully worked. I get it. It's an immense undertaking what they've done. Look at the grass in the background blowing. You walk through it, it moves the way you go. It's beautiful. It's amazing. It works. Kinda. Now, I, as much as the next person, am so glad that it's finally released and we will play it in its janky, janky form as it is right now. But something has got to give, guys. I've seen text errors. This, just the complete disregard for single player. No one cared about single player. It was all about multiplayer. And that's not this. And Mountain Blade was started as a single player only. From two people started that. Two people started the sandbox simulation. And here we are. Way later, after they've sold and sold and sold to companies and companies and companies, and look at what's happening. I'd rather have the damn. You look at this dude's neck. I mean, you could see where they connected. You could see the the geometric shapes where they were all weirded again. Yeah, but I didn't care about that. I didn't care at all about that. Graphics are good, yeah, but I still play. Little side scrollers. Graphics don't matter. Gameplay. Content. That's what matters. And they're skimming on the gameplay and the content to make everything look just crazy. You see, even this right here, that doesn't bother me. That irritates some people, but that doesn't bother me. That irritates people so bad. Yeah. It's a game, it's not real life. To get the physical, you know, you couldn't, no. Just chill. This is what we need. Thank you. Our realms should make peace. Is that an acceptable offer? No? Well, I'll give you a thousand dinars then. Oh, there's an acceptance bar. That's another thing. Why can't I manually put this in? Why do I sit here and click, 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 just to get the right number? Because I can sit here and slide all day. But look at that. We passed it by who knows how much. I guess I'm going to give you more than a thousand. I know, I made you mad. I'll give you 2,000 dinars. And then I'm going to go to the arena and show you guys what I'm talking about.
is accepted. Okay. So, we're now longer at war with this pitiful faction that I should never have gone to war with in the beginning. Because it cost me more to get out of the war than it did what I made from it. <sighs> Lovely. But, you know, maybe, maybe I'm kidding myself. Maybe it's too much to ask for them to do the simple little options. Maybe, maybe it's just too much to ask for people who... Yeah, I was reading the forums and it, it really cho choked me up because some people were just, just complete ignorant assholes who cared nothing of other people. This one gentleman was talking about his 61-year-old father playing the game. Called him and asked him if he could find the auto block direction. Oh, yeah, and after this update, it's getting even laggier. Now, granted, I'm fairly smooth, but do have some lag problems every now and then. Just little spikes. Oh. But, I mean, these guys are fast. Some people who don't have good coordination... Are not going to be as inclined to do this. And some people might even start demanding refunds because of this bull. It's a great game. It has so much more potential than what they've already given to it. But the fact that they've denied players the simplest of options that have been in both previous versions, Mountain Blade and Mountain Blade Warband. And all the mods slash updated versions like Fire and Sword. No. You guys, I can't believe it. I really can't. I can't believe they did that. That just doesn't even make sense, in my opinion. It makes about as much sense. Oh, it's milking a male cow. It just doesn't make any sense. You can't do it. I get it. If that's the way you want to play the game, fine. But there are other people. And see, he just shot me through a shield. <laughs> they got to fix some stuff. Major. And I can't believe they haven't fixed it in this many years of production. How many times these people must have played it. Never heard of a game taking this long and being this janky. At the end. Stuff going through shields. Yeah, let's see. Does my shield cover? Here. Oh, that one hit me in the side. So, it doesn't matter. You can't see it now anyway. But hopefully you'll understand what I what I mean. It taken away from the Mountain Blade experience. It's single player. Not having it in multiplayer, that's fine, but they've drove in, they've driven everything to multiplayer. That's where they want you to go. They want you to go to multiplayer. They want you to do this multiplayer. I'm sure they probably have freaking loot chests over there that you can buy with real money. I don't doubt it. I ain't played multiplayer yet. But that just seems the way it's going to go. And if it is, uh, uh, I won't support the next one. Because, hey, you know what? They, they sold this $10 cheaper than any other game. And then on top of that, there was a sale going on right now. And it's probably due to that air coronavirus. But I don't know. And I don't care about that. What I care about is the fact that they're trying to force people to play the game a way that they shouldn't have to because they didn't have to before. Which, hey, everybody plays the game in their own way. 
Some people use two-handed weapons. I, myself, use swords and shields. That's typically what I use. You know, one guy might use big, great maces. Everybody plays it differently. But giving options and then ripping options away. Eh. Because it wouldn't be hard for them to put that in there. Would not be hard at all. And leave it out of multiplayer if that's the route they want to go. Fine. Leave it out. Some people just don't have the reflexes, the coordination, and all the other good jazz and things. Why is that blue? Who knows why that's blue, but I don't. Now that I'm done ranting... What do we need to do? What were we doing? We were talking to Caladog. That's what we were doing. People walk around. Is Caladog here? He is. We'll just do that right there. Oh. Well, he's here. So, I guess I need to be in the keep. I guess they didn't have to bribe them again. Awesome. Didn't have to re-bribe the guards. My friend. You won't think that for long. Well, you might for a bit, but not right now. There's something I'd like to discuss with you. I would like to enter your service and pledge my allegiance and be counted among your loyal followers. You are known as a brave man and a fine leader of men, Nier. I shall be pleased to accept your sword into my service if you are ready to swear homage to me. I am ready, Kalodog. Good. Then repeat the words of the oath with me. I swear homage to you as lawful High King of the Batanians. Blah, blah. The powers of heaven and of the earth have entrusted to you the, garan the guardianship of this sacred land. But I shall stand by your side and not forsake you and fight until the life, my life, flees my body. I shall heed your judgments and pay you the tribute that is your due so that this land may have a strong protector. Very well, you have given me your solemn oath. May you uphold it always with proper courage and devotion. Let it be known that you are one of the Batanians. You may till our soil and sit at our councils. Who quarrel with you, quarrel with all of us. You have done a wise thing, Nier. Serve me well. And I promise you will rise high. I thank you, my lord. I have great hopes for you, Nier. I know you shall prove yourself worthy of the trust I have placed in you. Absolutely, Caladog. No way. Because <laughs> we are going to get that for ourselves. Oh. <sighs> Now that we have that, I wonder if it gave us a thief. Cannot open Clyde Wendell right now. He didn't say anything about giving us a thief. But maybe he did. On the down low. And we just don't know. Well, that ain't going to tell me anything. Can't just go from menu to menu. But this might. Uh, nothing. Okay, so I don't get to pick. I am green. Okay, that's no big deal. I kind of like the green anyway. No big deal at all. I guess that's the colors of, I don't know. I don't know. Doesn't matter though. Maybe that green will be noticeable in battle. Leaf Kingdom. 
now we have kingdom menu and there should be another menu here what is this but that's an army thing or something leave let's take our morale we're good still what is this army management okay that's what i was thinking influence cost okay so we could possibly like hey you guys and bring them in maybe okay we'll cancel that for now let's look at kingdom tab I've yet to see this Britannia diplomacy army politics fiefs and clans okay so the members of the fellow hide clan are of course my companions Spend my own influence to increase the influence of a selected clan. So, as far as that goes, Clan Pen Penric. Penric. I'm going to say Penric. I could support them. Propose we spell this clan from. Oh, man. You can get downright dirty with it. See, they've added all of this cool, awesome stuff, all of it, and yet they don't have auto blocking. Shame on them. <laughs> you know, who, okay, we're at war with the Western Empire, and we are sure winning. That's all I'll say is we are sure winning. <laughs> they have one city left from what I've seen. They're at peace with everybody else. That's fine. So, the Western Empire must be at war with a lot of people or something. That's the Northern Empire. That's the Western. I like it, because he was talking about how I'm the rightful king. I know how to fight. I know that. Yeah, yeah. I didn't like that guy. He was a... He sounded a bit like a... Like a wee-wee head. Somebody definitely peed in his Cheerios for sure. Well, now that we can, maybe it's time to go on a raid. Just maybe time to go on a raid. Now, I am going to extend the length of this one to kind of compensate for that shorty short one in the past video because they're updating this thing hour by hour. Now, we are for sure a part of a kingdom. Now, if we could... No, that's an Imperial City, though. That's the bad thing. Could we do some raiding, maybe? I'm just afraid we'd get mauled. I mean, maybe you can leave. Unlike Warband, where you just gotta sit there and just take it and take it. Where the enemy lords don't... <laughs> they can just run away. Ugh. Always hated that. You could never run away once you started it. It was a commitment you had to make. So we're going to test it. We're going to go for a raid. We got our boys back. We need to realign them. Let me look a little further into... Trained spearmen. Pole arms, 130. Their pole arms are low. Starlings, 130. So these guys have javelins. These guys don't. But they're trained spearmen. And that's what we're using them for, is spearmen. Because... We're going to need them 
if we ever go to war with the Valandians and we're at war with the Empire, which I know they have some good mounted troops. I'm sure of it. Cataphract. I mean, that whole word. Yeah, that's a mean mounted trooper. I can just imagine it. So, clan warriors are what we're going to take from them for right now. I may start out with a spear. Get a spear about that length right there. If I could get a spear about that length right there, that'd be the perfect spear for me. La 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 la. Perfect. Here, Gary tops the rubber. Uh, like, you're a little nuts sometimes, in my opinion. You sound a little nuts, dude. That's how it will be. Though saith near fellow hide. Now, I am curious about that whole, I don't know if they're going to follow me, if I, or how that works. I'm not sure. I need to do a little more research about that. But, I mean, if they follow me, it'd be a good way to, yeah, I doubt they do, though. I mean, I'm sure you, since they're your you know, clan and everything, you'd be like, hey, come on, and they might do it, but if that is the case, then this dude right here just might make a good fodder captain for a while. Maybe. We'll have to see. Oh, I guess green is, green is, yeah, our guys. I mean, we're already green, but that green. <laughs> After we get done with this raid, we're going to see what we can do about increasing our relations with the Finn Penrick clan. Because he, the leader of said clan, was an enemy of Caladog. And I would very, very much like to have an enemy of Caladog as my ally. Because as far as I can come through here, but this is definitely a more cooler trek in the winter. It would be harder to move troops. From my understanding, that is a thing. Harder to move, less morale, just altogether bad experience at times. So we're going to march through these trees. Get to this village, try to raid it, see what happens. Hopefully no Western Empire people come up to us. That's what we're watching for. I think they're going for the village too. That's fine. Y'all can stand here and guard me if y'all want. <laughs> I'm almost certain that's where they were headed. All right, we saved. So, take hostile action. We're going to raid the village. Yep. And they're helping me. It would seem like... I can end raiding. Okay, good. Is that all we got was grain? Is that all we got from that was grain? Okay, I guess it was. Uh, it was a little disappointing. I keep forgetting about the sword. <sighs> it's a little less speed. Ooh, does she sting when she touches you? Where's my shield maiden? Yeah, 
We get for Dawnbreaker. Who's that? Best of Icons is what that was. Hmm. What in the world? I wish to discuss with you. All right, go on. What we did to that village, I don't like it. These farmers, they're a lot like my people. I want to know it won't happen again. As your leader, I am uh, I am able to decide the best course of action. Look, Garatops. I get it. We all don't like raiding villages. Sometimes. We have to. Okay? You are cool and chill until now. I need you to stay that way, please. I mean, is that all they have is this one city holdout? No, they have a castle. And just because I can. Save and load. I'm going to go and see what is in this castle. No, better yet, I am going to help in the siege here. Go ahead and save. Because these guys are just waiting. They really are. They're just waiting. That's the leader. Yes, yes, yet. Yeah, there's 11 guys left. Oh, uh, well. Who cares? We're going to attack. I gotta press it twice. I guess I gotta, I gotta press it twice to get that attack on. All I can say is the Western Empire is about to be completely obliterated. They'll be down to nothing but a castle. Oh, it's not looking good for them either. I can't believe that already. One faction's about to bite the dust. This will be my first taste of siege combat. Granted, it's not really a siege with 11 defenders, but it'll be my first taste. I can already tell that this is not going to be good. I'm lagging just by moving my camera here. I got a bad feeling we're going to crash. The other thing I was reading on the forums is that the single player sieges seem to be having a lot of issues where the multiplayers are just fine. And you see, way back, I think it was two years ago, I was reading something that it was the multiplayer sieges that were giving them so much problems and why they hadn't released the game yet. I mean, I can't, I don't know if I can, can I, I guess I could tell him not to put it out there. I'm not, I'm not doing that. Let's begin the assault and hope we don't just crash. Oh man, I'm getting some lag. I am getting lag. I can only imagine what y'all are getting. I mean, it ain't like. They really stand a chance. We're going to move that tower anyway. Come on, man. Get this ladder. I mean, I'll do it by myself if I have to. Whoa. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. This is bad. This is really bad. Uh, 
I'm just curious if the defenders can knock the ladders down. I'm moving at the speed of a snail. Oh, man. I'm going to have to turn the army. Yeah, we start actually sieging. I'm going to have to turn the army count down or something because that's bad. Oh, yeah, you can. Oh, I don't know how I succeeded in that. Oh, this is terrible. Oh, talk about slow motion combat. Oh. You see, he hit me when I had my shield up. Looks like I had it on my screen. I guess it's that latency. Come back here. I'll chase you in slow motion if I have to. Come on. I didn't want that way. But I'll take it. My lord have mercy. This is awful. I mean, I've got a decent computer. It's only 500 men. I get all the effects and stuff. Lord. If it was 700, is the max I had on Conquest before my game just utterly died? And I mean, I was getting lagged once they started colliding with each other. Yeah, this is gonna be really hard to tell who's your guys and who's not your guys. Which I mean, that's realism. I guess if somebody's coming at you with their blade in the air, <laughs> they're not yours. But like this dude, yeah. size down just keep that from happening Fen Penrick. Penrick. Of the ancient legions of the Batanians. I am Lord of Siona. I know your name. I heard you've pledged allegiance to our Lord Caladog, fighting against our foes with valor, but also with honor and compassion. A good name is as valuable as a sharp sword or a swift horse in affairs of arms. Okay, so that's the kind of general he is. I want to join your army. Very well, follow us. Something I would like to discuss. They benefit us both. Is it a cow? No. I'm not going to do that. That's fine. All right, then. Oh, we don't have enough troops for this task. Oh man, what kind of a task is it? Options. Back on. Where's the battle size? Yeah.
down to about yeah 160 170 troops on each side I think that would still be good a lot better than 150 total I'm not leaving the army we should choose our next objective and how about we might go that for more information does it tell me my relation with them no it doesn't no food for nine days well i, I assume that this is going to be yeah take out the castle I mean the remnants of the empire would just they'll either absolve into another section or something I don't know how all this is gonna go exactly and Veros I wonder if they are enemies of Caladog as well. I don't see Veros on the Batanians. Mina's party. Okay, so, Minas, party, let's, uh, yes, um, guess he's not, I mean, I don't get that, Batanians, would be a mercenary. Imperial, 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 Veros, Clan Veros, I wonder if she wasn't an Imperial. Manipulative. She's an enemy of Caladog. How that exactly the whole clan thing fits into it. Wealthy members of the old Imperial Senate, in whom he recognized a rising star, girls provided the fame, she provided the money, and Eve. <laughs> yeah, that's a. <laughs> Even if the populous general ever puts up with his land redistribution schemes into practice, few doubt Apis would find. Way to emerge even richer than before. Yeah, I don't like you, dude. That's what I'm curious of here. I need to start thinking about getting a lineage going, an actual lineage. Seeing how all that works exactly. for eight days hopefully did y'all decide to do it without the tower 
for me. They've got some troops now. Well, this will be my first real taste of siege combat. So, let's get it started. Hopefully, we won't blah, 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 lag to death. Everything else has been smooth to this point, but I did read something on the forums talking about it. So, let's see how this works. Well, that's already smoother. Oh, but then it started to lag a little. We're lagging a little bit. It's not too bad. It's a little bit. I dare not try to get those ladders up by myself. Oh, come on. Could have swore that was a guy. <laughs> I'm sitting here shooting it. Stone. Well, why not try? I can get these ladders up before our men get here. Maybe we'll have an easier time getting up them. I didn't get hit. I didn't get hit. Yeah, help me get this up. Thank you, buddy. Oh, I missed the ladder. Let me on that ladder. Look, guys. I'm a commander. Let me on the ladder. Cool. We're lagging a little bit. Uh, one can hope that we get on the wall and not just die. Okay, we didn't. Yes. Three to us. Four. Mm. What hit me? I don't know. I really hope this isn't too laggy for y'all. It's lagging a little bit for me. Oh, he was sneaky. tower needs to drop. There's nobody even over here. You're dead. Oh, they seen me. That's yeah, when they start clustering up like this real bad. That's Probably have to turn the men down more to a flat 300. 150 on both sides. May only be able to do 100 on both, 100 on each side instead of 75. I mean, uh, that's gonna kill it a little bit, but that's what I've been waiting for forever. Is the large battles. Isn't any unit under your command? Okay. Hmm. So 
there anyone up here? I've seen men running this way. Their directional sound is messed up too. I'm hearing all this in my right headphone and there's obviously not a massive battle going on over there. Yeah, I don't think there's anybody over here. Where are you going? Did you come to meet my sword? Where are y'all going? Don't tell me you guys are trying to flee. They are. They don't even care I'm stabbing them. They're just trying to flee. We need to leave, guys. Hell, if they're going to rout, I'm just going to stab them. I can move and slash at the same time. Oh, they gave a charge order. Oh, I bet those guys are falling back. I'm getting real bad lag. Oh, that was the route. And then as soon as they all piled up in there, my game got clear. Yeah, I'm hearing everything on my left headphone for this. <laughs> oh, man. So, how many did I take out? I killed 14. Hell yeah. Gate influence. I'll take prisoners. Hell yeah, I'll take prisoners. I guess that's a short spear, and it's longer than spear. <laughs> well, you know me, taking everything that isn't nailed down, might as well. Taken by an army which you are a member. Yeah, what is that? That was their last. Let us change this. Three hundred flat and see if that helps. I may need to turn that. I'm gonna turn that down. I'm gonna turn make sure everything's on medium for this, because that is a bit much. Something's going off. Yeah, I mean, I, I shouldn't be having problems, really. But, we seem to be, so... Let's see what we can do to fix it, maybe.
my men are gathered. Speaking of, how did I forget them? Finally. Or if they got deserters. They must have deserters or something. That number just keeps going down. that damn hungry. Nothing. So we do have several weapons. Oh, I forgot the most important thing. Food. Food. I just keep getting these things. That's what I'm going to do. So let's talk one handed axes. It won't be anything special. I mean, maces. Ooh. Dang sickly. Good old flange mace. What'd that say? Pernot shed. Heavy royal. Yeah, that would hurt. That hurt something fierce. They call this a flanged mace. Okay. Now you call it what you want to call it because you call a falchion what I call a scimitar. And I know medieval weaponry. So. Oh, 
swirly mace. Swirly, swirly. <laughs> Spiraled mace head. Light southern mace head. And of course, this spiked club head. Okay. Iron bill head. I guess that's, that's not a mace. <laughs> that's a bill. That's a bill hook. It is not a mace. Hammerhead. Okay. Pole arm here. We got. See, this is how we get the spear we want. Let's see. Go to the haft. What's the weapon reach? Whew. That's as small as I can get it, huh? 138. Oh. Okay. Double huge hooks with fur covering. Does it say it does more damage? No. Actually increases the handling. But, you know, if you just wanted, if, I mean, that's what you wanted was this long spearhead. <laughs> Go for it, guys. They do have pommels. Another spearhead. There we go, we can zoom out. I like that. Knobby riveted. That's always good. And that, yeah. You need to stab somebody behind you quickly. Yeah, I'm just playing around now. Mace. I already looked at maces, didn't I? Yeah. Two hand mace. Mallet head. That's all I got. Big ass. War hammer. It's a mallet. War mallet. You could say throwing. Like you can make your own throwing knives. What? So can you make your own? You can. Okay, so they three different heads. Missile error text. This <laughs> just <laughs> Oh, you guys gotta be kidding me. Everybody else might be able to see this day, right? Two handed swords. Does it have the spatha blade? There's a Falx blade. Yeah. Saber blade. Hmm. <laughs> These guys are nuts. That is all I have to say. Even if you just needed a dagger, just needed a quick stick, stick, stick them into pointy end. Here you go. We got all kinds of stuff for you. All kinds. Javelins. Ooh. Oh. Just to make it look cool. Tree branch. <laughs> A literal tree branch. They weren't lying. A pine. Ash. Oaken. Mahogany. So I guess these are just 
No, they do have a... They affect the damage, too. I guess the longer the shaft... The more damage it does, that doesn't make sense. Why the longer the shaft would increase the damage. Now, the bigger the head on a javelin would. So right here we just have a big skewer. Big old skewer. Skewer them right up. Anyway, that's not what we're doing. We're gonna make a one-handed axe just to make one. Sequel blade. <laughs> And a gnarled branch. Why is there going to be a reflection? Really, that just doesn't make sense. Just hurt somebody's eyes. Or we can make another one handed sword. I don't have any different. Did we get a different blade? Yeah, we did. Steel war sword blade. I don't know what all this means. Ooh. Ooh, no, yeah, we can't make that yet. <laughs> if we could, maybe. There you go. That's a broad saber is what that is. Okay, well, yeah, we're not smelting yet. We're just continuing our refining journey. Now we're done. Glad we can do no more. Trade. All right. Gotta be big enough to cover him, or it's not gonna be any point in having it. What do you got? Tempered Northern Blade, okay. They're all fixed up. Now we're going to go rejoin the army. Really should buy food from villages. It's cheaper. Place some dead if we had any. Eighteen days before the asteroid hits Earth. No, before we run out of food. Oh, eighteen days worth of food. Now, if we can get back with this army, I don't know what we're gonna do. Not a clue what we're doing. We're chilling here for some reason. We have another job to do. Well, let's go do it. Because I'm paying troop wages. Yeah, quite a bit right now. So, let's go do it. Whoa, vote for land tax. 
Do you want to resolve land tax decision? Do what? Okay. I guess I can wait for a bit or something. Okay, a uh, shift in the tax system that puts more emphasis on property and less on the head tax charge to everyone could collect more from wealthy landowners. 5% of the village income is paid to the ruler clan as tax. 5% less village income for clans. I don't know about that. Well, so the village income is paid to the ruler clan as tax. The ruler clan. So this is going to make it to where Well, this can say whatever it wants, but what this is saying is that 5% of the village income is paid to the ruler clan as tax. It is a ruler of the clan. It says ruler clan. So I'm assuming that means like Caladog's clan because he's the ruler of the Batanians, which would give the vassals 5% less village income. Look at him in any way. I can't. Okay, so. Melon deer. Fen U. Uvain. Fen Uvain. Okay, that's their clan. Now. Penrick. He has one ally from Fenton Penrick. Maximin Tadios. They're not. Well. Not sure about this. And Gial. Gial. He is friends with Caladog. Musair. Chiefs of the Batanians and then Fengal, an old family of the realm. He has a reputation for being mad, bad, and dangerous to know. <laughs> okay. Okay, you can. <laughs> I mean, seriously. Peace for being a bit of a. Shrieker. Okay. Here's the thing.
Oh, I can't even vote anyway. All I can do is abstain. I have enough influence, apparently. It's not what I've seen, but whatever. Uh, just didn't what I mean really why would that even come up if I couldn't do anything with it <sighs> well food for 12 days maybe we'll finally catch this guy just keep chasing him we're gonna run him to the sea eventually <laughs> we have another job to do quit running back and forth has been dispersed okay fine that's fine and well for me. I wonder if they will come to my aid if I attack. Oh! Do you have anything to say before I give the order to attack? Hey, do. Mina's party came to help me. Good. He looks wounded. Uh, we'll fight our last drop of blood. All right, we'll see how this goes. Hopefully it's not a terrible kick in the butt, but my ally is just charging. No formation, no nothing, just charge. Oh, but that's probably because it's only the enemies who are smart enough to do such a thing. up boys Archer infantry Attack I thought that's what I'd hear There goes my horse. I am not the one who's going to die today. The odds are not in our favor. Mm. Oh no. Oh 
Hold up your shields. Come on, guys. Don't worry about the damn cavalry. Yeah, the sound's messing up on me. Okay, ah! adequate skill. I don't know where you guys are at right now. But, of course, my allies didn't come with me. If we'd have just pushed when I pushed. Fusion is some of the best tools a soldier can have. Confusion. Ooh! I thought that was my enemy. Thought he had me. Because you can't catch him. Twelve guys. Oh, a trained infantrymen. Three normal infantrymen. This is mainly volunteers who died. That's the big. Wait, no, that's that's unconsciousness. Yeah, recruits and uh, lost some infantrymen, but we'll get them back. We'll get some troops back. Emos, we are at your mercy. Yes, you are. Well, I mean, don't get me wrong, these guys, I'm sure, are some really badass guys, but one horseman? Hey, wages of a 16. Yeah. Now, prisoners. Uh, he's tier 5. So you know they're going to be worth some money. that I 
hold 25. Me all of it. It has been a while because I remember talking to you now. Most elegant admirer. Yes. That quick and easy for Imperial Ally. We meet from time to time as is custom to see if we might I as it is custom to see if we are right for each other. I hope to see you again soon. Okay, so nothing on there, uh, maybe that started a romantic interest, let me talk to her again and see. Let's get to know each other. Feel lucky to live in an age when a valiant warrior, when a valiant warrior can a name for herself. Tail worlds, you guys have got to stop this. So, I feel lucky to live in an age when a valiant warrior can a name for herself. That isn't even sound good. Was a success. Like you wouldn't believe. Fascinating stuff, all of it is. Mm -hmm. Now, this was like completely unintentional, but if we can get an early solidified marriage with a powerful family, it might help us in the long run. Oh, as long as our score settles, you can be sure of that. Okay, some people say you will go far. Suppose you were to rise to a position of power, what would you do? Hmm, first thing I'd do is in power is to work on a plan to remain in power. It seems we have a fair amount in common. Perhaps we can talk more when we meet again. Okay. So let's... We're going to end it here, and when we come back, we're going to explore this a little bit more, maybe solidifying an alliance through marriage. Well, if you like the video, please leave the thumbs up and subscribe. really helps me out. Thank you, and you all have a wonderful day.